So I'm going to connect a motor controller that will be able of controlling the servo motor and a temperature sensor. And I will hook up the temperature to make the motor move and indicate the different temperature values. First thing, I will just hook up the motor controller for simplicity to here. See, as soon as I plug it in, it starts blinking, showing that the, the communication is happening towards the hub. And I plug in the temperature sensor. Same thing here, it starts blinking automatically. If I go down to the IDE, I could drag in a temperature sensor, it's automatically recognized and corresponds to this temperature sensor here. We'll rest at the temperature, we're just touching the sensor directly with my finger. In this room, I can probably make it rise up to like 25, 26 degrees winter in Sweden. And then I can drag in a motor controller here. It's automatically recognizing the only motor controller device that is plugged in right now. If I had multiple motor controllers, I could just click on the device and then choose the right one. And then I'm going to just map the temperature to the movement of the motor. I will just need to uh, <coughs> change the values here. And I mean, this one can probably make the temperature go between like 14 or 15 degrees and up to, as I said, 20 something or 30. And I'm going to map it to the movement of a standard servo motor that goes between 0 and 180. Mm -hmm. And I can plug in the motor and see how it works. Just make sure I plug the power in the right location. And you see how the temperature changes. The motor changes. Just for the fun of it, in this case, we've made a temperature display. You can see here, and now we just plug in the motor. This here will tell us that it's hotter temperature or a colder temperature. And just to prove that you can push it even further down, I have here a glass with ice cubes. And we just protect the circuit a little bit so it doesn't get destroyed. And here you go. The temperature will now go quickly down. There you go. Thank you very much.